Hi guys, the channel's been a bit quiet lately. Some of that's COVID nonsense, some of it's um, work. Um, but we've also recently bought a house in Spain. This is the, our new balcony. Um, great views. Um, we've just started the renovations on it, so I'll just run you through some of this stuff. All this is coming out. Um, what we're going to do is take this out, take the window out, and this will have like a conservatory styled building on the top here uh, with glass walls that fold so you can slide it out so you can get the air through. No point cooling the room if you just need to open the doors because you can get the wind and breeze off, this, off the water. That will sort of come to about here where this line is. And then this will be glass all the way around and down here. Be a little grass area here for Zoe, so she's got her own little area with a hammock, chill out. Because once I put the door there, my side's that side, this will be her area. I tell you what, it's bloody hot now, the sun's just come out, it's been raining all day, and then as soon as I go outside do a video, does he beam or not? This is uh, where my office sort of will be. I've got all this stuff here, um, but I'm tempted at the minute just to leave it for now. Got somebody come and pick the washing machine up. Um, it's an old one. So I've sold that. But I've got the water heater here, but I think I'm eventually going to put solar water heater on the roof, then feed back down here. I'm going to have to have a think about this area here because I, I want this as my office area. Um, but if I knock this through, I can use the conservatory to be out there, so I might even end up just halving this, putting a small door on it, so we keep it for the water. Um, washing machine doesn't need to be here, it'll be downstairs. Still a work in progress, I already fit the new light up there. Done a few spot repairs here. New light on the stairs. It's a bit dark down here. All the lights gone. This is the main room. Let's uh, put the new lights in. Get a little bit of spot art taxi. Not the best art taxi, but I never claim to be a plasterer or somebody who does art tech. Um, What's fit some new sockets next door and they've come through the wall. I thought there was a bit of a cavity in there. Guess what? There's not. <laughs> so I've started wiring the new sockets in and it's come through the wall. April just said, did you notice the hole in the wall? I'm like, no. <laughs> Obviously the USB sockets going in there. This will be the lad's bedroom. The wardrobes are nearly there. It's, uh, there was a horrible pine, but April's giving them some coats of paint. New ceiling fan. And he's got it's got a nice view from here as well. So this room will stay cool most of the year. Nice little, I don't know if you can see, getting a bit clear. So that's his view over there. Don't think they're gonna build, build that property there anytime soon. But this has all been April's work, painting, door nelps, all that sort of lovely stuff. This is Zoe's room. Hen's multicolored fan. It's exactly the same fan. The colors are on the other side, uh, on this side, and the other side's white. So it's the same as Ruby's room. Same wardrobe, first coat already gone on. Still got a sea view. All these windows and shutters and everything are coming out because the new, the new shutters are pretty much to that size. <laughs> so. So all this is gone. This is a complete waste of space. You'll see why in a minute. But I've got all the sockets to do. I'm not doing too much now. Um, I'm going back to work shortly. And in all honesty, um, I'm waiting for the windows to get ripped out. Put a new bathroom lighting in here. But all this is going. Got a new vent to go in, because it doesn't actually have one. So, go get that. Got to get a vent over to there somehow. I'm going to have to mess around with digging through the floor, something I did not want to do, but hey ho. Oh, this is my favourite light. 
Um, I won't play it now, but it's got a speaker in the middle of it. So when you play music, it actually echoes through the whole house. You know, it's quite a, quite good for acoustics, actually. Um, sounds really good. So that's the rooms. We'll go downstairs, one of the downstairs. I'm going back to work in a second. That's that one. That's that one on the stairs, off you go. One thing I did like in here is the stairs. The stairs, stairs are pretty good quality. Hate the pine, hate the pine. So dated. But I'm just going to paint that all in grey. We've already upgraded those sockets here. And the switches, well, the switches here. Now we're downstairs, new fans already gone in. Um, ripped all this off because I didn't like all the coven and stuff in the middle. It just looked tacky. And I've ripped it all the, there's a picture rail all the way around. So all that's going to be skimmed all the way around. Took all the Artex off the kitchen ceiling, stripped all that. No, can't do any more at the minute because the windows are coming out. Um, that one's getting bricked up, so that'll be gone. That extract vent has got to be brought all the way over across and down there, so there's a new extract. Um, seven, win seven weeks for the new windows. Um, so at the moment, I'll probably be back before the windows turn up. So that's got to get done, can't do anything about it. New doors, because an internal and external door. External door is probably going to be similar to this, but we're still discussing um, because we're looking at a solid door for the inside, but it's got a side panel here, um, which has louvers for ventilation. So we're talking about whether to do that. At which point you could have two solid doors or whatever she wants. If you can have what she likes. Um, and this is the sitting room area. That's the new TV unit, which goes across, across the window and up. Um, currently not installed because we're going to rip the window out <laughs> and that's the gap as you can see here all this will be gone so I can't do any work until the windows are in now because uh, they're gonna have to plaster everything the reveal once all this has come out frustrating so I'm now at a point of okay I can't do much more no point doing the ceilings and that yet because all this is going to come out. I don't know how much damage it's going to do internally, so I might as well just wait. No point spending a bit of money fixing it for it to get destroyed. So we just put the fans in, so that's ready to go. It's a new dining room light, which is going over here a little bit. Took it out the middle. Um, somebody had originally moved it across by about a foot to put it in line with that one. Uh, but we actually want to want a cross for the suit the dining table. This is the weird toilet. There's the lights on here. Another one, poor ventilation. So we've got to sort the extract out in here as well. My final light switch. So this is the toilet design for hobbits. Because I'm not being funny, that's that's way below what I could, you know, unless you were uh, shooting from a distance, whatever. This is quite a difficult spot to get into. So that's getting ripped out. Um, so the washing machine will end up down there. And this will end up with a toilet where the sink is built into the system. So it's similar to a Japanese toilet. So you can wash your hands on the in the system part and it fills it up for the next flush. How environmental? Well, it's environmental in the fact that it actually fits in the space. All good. Then April's kitchen will be here, which sort of goes round there, round, round, and extends across the front for half a window. Because uh, one thing April loves is the kitchen space, so I'm not grumbling. She looks after the kids and does all the the cooking, so tell her she has what she likes. And what's on the floor here is our new canopy. Uh, I don't know if you can see that. Massive canopy. Um, which I think it's three and a half meters long by, and it extends out by two and a half meters. So that, I'm going to get absolutely blitzed with the sun. So that will go about four blocks up on the top here above the window and it will extend just to the wall here. So this area here is pretty much completely covered from, from here 
to about to about here. So you can sit out here, chilled out. Kids can have a paddling pool or whatever they want under here. Oh, beer truck's being delivered. Not to my place. <laughs> um, but it's getting there. Windows are going to take a lot of work. As you can see here, this is the old one. So the, the, the steel, they've had a um, it's like concrete with steel bar, it rebar. And it's just perished because we're right next to the beach. So the new one's going in. All that's coming back to here. Then this will be marble. So it'll be marble that way. Marble sh um, seal. Marble plate at the bottom. Then a marble face all the way around. Um, but looking forward to it getting finished. Quite happy with the place. Although it's a lot of work because of its location. Um, once it's renovated, financially it's a good investment. But yeah, fair bit of tidying up still to do. Very like sitting down here. I think we'll get the pool down here and the barbecue down here. And chill out. But stuck now, I'm gonna wait seven weeks. If you want to watch the videos of the bits and pieces I've been doing, they're on the Alicante channel. Um, but I thought I'd do an update because I know some of you guys have been wondering where I am. It's quite simply, I'm just stupidly busy, guys. Um, Alright, I'll catch up with you soon. Take it easy.